Wildfires around the world are growing more destructive. In the western U.S. state of Colorado, forest crews work to reduce the risk. We are thinning the forest. I'm currently limbing up this tree. Left behind in a forest, wood chips and thinned out logs can still burn. Hauling them out is expensive. So foresters outside the city of Boulder are testing a more natural way to make deadwood quickly disappear. It's a fungi way. So some of these wood chips that you see behind us, we've actually donated for the inoculation projects for mushrooms to help with fire mitigation. At the Mycology Center Boulder Mushroom, founder Zach Hedstrom tends dozens of small petri dishes that hold local wild mushroom fungi. We culture these strains out of our environment and bring them into our lab and isolate them and then we study the ways that they can be used. For instance, a super hot wildfire can sterilize land and leave it prone to mudslides. Hedstrom says new seedlings have a better chance of stabilizing burned out areas if fungi are mixed with their planting soil. Mycorrhizal fungi help plants share water, share nutrients. Restoring one hectare of forest can take a ton of fungi. To make enough, Hedstrom's team adds tiny doses to hundreds of bags of growing mix. Within days, the bags fill with fungal roots, mycelium, ready for wildfire mitigation. The solid state inoculant is either spread by hand and then we also utilize a liquid inoculant, which is a slurry of mycelium that can be sprayed. Wood chips are a frequent target for mushroom mitigation. In Evergreen, Colorado, piles like these can increase wildfire risk for decades. Forester Jeff Ravage walks to a mound that used to be another giant wood chip pile. He sped up its decomposition with wild local fungi. It took two years to do what would uh, take nature 20 to 50 years. So it's over a 10 time uh, acceleration of natural forces. To avoid invasive species, Ravage says it's crucial to use local wild fungi. Done correctly, the payoff is something unlikely to burn and so beneficial that Ravage scoops up a handful of decomposed chips <sighs> and breathes them in. That's the stuff. It's not rancid. It's not woody, smells like beautiful soil. Mushroom mitigation pioneers are hoping to expand their efforts to help people anywhere who are threatened by wildfires. Shelley Schlender, VOA News, Boulder, Colorado.